In the heart of Bremen, in northern Germany, stands an extraordinary building. Completed in 1931, House Atlantis was designed as an institute for the study of Atlantis and the Aryan super race. The building's facade was originally adorned by a large wooden sculpture depicting the Nordic god Odin, crucified on the Tree of Life. Inside House Atlantis, an astonishing stairwell, built of glass and steel. It may evoke the Aryan exodus from Atlantis. At the top, the visitor enters a mysterious room. Known as the Heaven's Hall, this was to be the teaching forum for the twisted ideologies of Hermann Wirth. Hermann Wirth was quite fascinated by the idea of finding Atlantis. His idea was that this Atlantis was not somewhere in the Mediterranean or something like that, but in the North Atlantic region. And in his idea, in Atlantis, 20 to 25,000 years ago, a Nordic race was created that was to control and influence the development of mankind to a strong degree. Soon, the highest echelons in Germany are paying attention to Wirth's bizarre pseudo-history. In 1935, Himmler joins forces with Wirth to establish the Anenerbe, an elite SS unit consisting of archaeologists, scientists, and historians. Their mission? To search the sacred sites of the world for evidence that the Aryans of Atlantis were not mythological. Himmler wants proof they actually existed. As head of the SS, Himmler was fascinated by the idea of proving the supremacy of the Nordic race. And he was the strongest supporter of archaeologists researching on prehistoric German grounds. The Annen Erbe turned their focus on ancient sacred sites, among them the Externstein. A major excavation begins, commanded by Wilhelm Teut. Their mission is to prove that the Externstein was used for sacred rituals by Nordic German descendants of the Aryans, thousands of years before it became a Christian sacred site. During the search for their Germanic Nordic roots, the Externstein comes to symbolize pure German heritage. The excavations at the Externstein become Himmler's pet project. Meanwhile, Himmler sends Annen Erbe teams across the world to hunt for proof of the German people's Aryan origins. But modern research is proving that the Nazi theories were fundamentally flawed. <laughs> 